Yeah, that's her little house. <laughs> uh, sorry, lady, but uh, yeah, she's at least she willing to give up. Um, okay, I'm just trying to figure out because I was, I went to a different place last week and wasn't there. And then I guess they gave directions that it'd be here. They said there's a white Chevy. Okay. Um, and it, I know it ain't that one, so I'm thinking it's that building. Anybody in here? Hello? Yep. It's definitely somebody's house. Repo time! Hello, hello! Got another storage shit pick up. Uh, 10 by 12. Don't have too much information on this one. Sometimes I have more information, sometimes I have less information. So, I just gotta go and see what I get into. Should be coming up here. One of these houses. Seven. So. Let me... See if I can find it. Then it's row three. Go to the next house. Gotta turn this off. Well, I found it it's in there behind the trees. There's a couple old vehicles in there for sale. So if I can't get the building, maybe I'll buy a car. Who knows? Doesn't look like the most exciting place to go into. A little bit on the trashy side. Right after my coffee, we'll go check it out. Security camera. I'm here about the uh, storage building that the um, you guys are renting and apparently payment's not being made so they send it out to either get her to get payment. Well, she's out there in it. Somebody's living in it? She is. Okay. Who's she? The okay. one that it's like your owes you the money. Daughter or? Yeah. Okay. Alright, I'll go talk to her then. Thank right. you. This shall be interesting. You in there? I'm just here to get the bill and get payment. I'm here about the building because the payment's not being made, so they want us to pick it up. Okay. Because that's your house, huh? Yeah, I'm kind of staying there at the moment. Um, okay. I'm actually looking to, because I just got back to work and I get paid Thursday. Is there any way I can make a payment Thursday? I have to find out how much you owe on it. I don't know how much behind you 1400. are. 1400 1400 uh, That's That's the pay it off. 
I'm also looking to get a payment made and I'm also got it on like Facebook to get it sold because I need to so you're trying to sell it yeah so I can get it paid off right um hmm so you're are you 1400 is what you owe on it still or okay but that's not what you're behind on payments. I don't know what you're behind on payments. I don't know. But... I haven't made a payment since March. Okay. So that's a good five or six months. Okay. Um, yeah, once you're that far behind and they send it out to pick it up, then they expect us to get it. Is that what you're so, trying to do today? Or? Yeah. That's what they... Because we... They obviously couldn't get a hold of you or something and then they send it out to pick it up. So, and I don't know if, well, I don't know how much you get out of it by selling it, but I don't see you really gaining just, anything by doing that. Well, I got people interested for 2500 they're not going to pay it off. Right. But then the problem they run into that is if, if well, actually, you're not even legally allowed to, to sell it. Let's oh. put it that way. I mean, if you can come up with an agreement with them, mm -hmm. but at this point you don't own the shit because you're renting it, so you're not you're not allowed to sell their shit without having agreement with them. But if I get some money and pay them, wouldn't it be my shed? If you once you pay them for it, yeah. But until you pay them for it, it's not yours. So you're selling their shit. So. I don't know what how much stuff you got in there, but I think that's well, gonna be the option is to get it. Just they want me to pick it up and get it out of here. Um, can I see if I can call them real quick to see if they'll wait until Thursday? Yeah. Okay. Give me yeah. a minute. You got the phone number for them or I think it should be in my phone. Yeah. I mean I can get you I can get you the right number for the the person that goes straightly to the right guy. Need me one second, please. Okay. Let you take the shed. Okay. Um, is there any way that I can have some time to get stuff out of it? Because it's kind of well, let me see. full of storage. Just give okay. me a little bit and I will get it all cleaned up for you. Okay. Yeah. Um, Sometimes I, be at I work just by one forty five, so it'd definitely be done by Yeah. Well I mean I got nothing else to do. So it it works better for me to just help me get the stuff out and get I'm it because kind of private. If if you just want to sit in your truck, I'll go ahead and get okay. everything out. And because you can see that leaks and I've been asking for every year for it to be fixed. Hmm. And nobody's come to fix it. I see. So I can I'll just take my loss. Yeah. Okay. Alright, well, um, yeah, I'll give you maybe 45 minutes or so. I appreciate it. I'll have it all stuff done. Out then. And then I don't know where you're going to put it. Just make sure I can get to the end there with my mule to, to pull it out. Okay. So I have to come in through there and get to that end. Okay. And then, okay, I'll all give right, you some time. You. Yep. Huh. Well, okay then. Damn, the mosquitoes are horrible. I got like, I don't know how many bites I got back there just standing there. Yeah, that's her little house. <laughs> uh, sorry, lady, but uh, yeah, she's at least she willing to give up. Um, of course, one of the things she did is say that she wants to maybe sell the building and then she can pay it off and I told her that was illegal and I need to uh, I need to double check on that make sure I got my facts straight but I I look at it as pretty similar like I, I told her is you're renting this thing rent to own that's not yours and you can't sell something that you don't own that's never legal so um, I don't know what I need to ask the rent to own company sometime how they feel about it I'm sure if it comes down to it, if they sell it and they pay them, they don't care. I mean, it's they are, they just want to get paid for you know the building they paid for and are renting to them. But 
if what happens is they sell them and then they don't go and pay them so uh yeah i told her i'd give her about 45 minutes to get her stuff out she didn't want me to help because it's her stuff so i might just go and maybe i'll go see if i can find me a bite to eat and i'll come back we'll see or i'll go after another one down the road we'll see we'll just see okay so i'm trying to find a different building now to pick up and then i'll go back to get the other one um this is one I was after last week and I showed up at the address and it wasn't there and so I was able to get a contact information for the guy and apparently the rent don't come and I was able to get a hold of him and they told him where it is but I just got some weird direction with some not very clear directions no address except for you know the road up here it looks like I probably drove right past it that day because I delivered one and then I went to repo this one and I drove right past it uh, but I had no idea it was there so I'm not sure if it's on this road it says there's a white Chevy and there's a building right across from a small road which I remember seeing and then there's a white Chevy which happens to be the truck I drive so I'm not sure Okay, here's the building. Oh, I see it up there. I see it. All right, let me pull in here. So there's a red barn, but that's that's wider than the one I'm looking for. So I'm a little bit confused. Hey, I'm able to get off the road just barely. So we'll go in there and it's the one I'm getting says the size of it's uh uh where am I again? 10 by 20. That looks like at least a 12 by 20. But sometimes that they put it down wrong. Oh, it ain't this one. Hello. Sorry. I... No, you're good, you're good. Okay. I didn't want him to get out on the road there. Yeah, um, did you need What's that? Did you need um, I'm here about that building, I think. Okay. I don't know if for sure I'm at the right place, but. Oh, there you are. Um, Come here, buddy. There we are. Okay. Um, the, I'm showing a building size 12 by tw uh, 10 by 20. And uh, I guess. The name on it does that sound like that building or i would have to meet up to ask my fiance i have no idea okay so do you I'm know on... or do you know who that is i recognize the name but okay i'm not friends with the same people that is so okay he's got a lot of friends that okay i'm just trying to figure out because i was i went to a different place last week and wasn't there and then i guess they gave directions that it'd be here they said there's a white chevy okay. um and it, I know it ain't that one, so I'm thinking it's that building, but... This is the newer one we bought, so... Is it yours, or... Do you know? We, I, well, we or, paid, paid, we gave somebody money for it. I don't know who. Oh, you... know that we paid for it, so... Okay. <laughs> it might be in a situation with that. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have a way of getting hold of him? Yeah, he just left for work. Let me go get my phone. Okay. I know he's driving the dump truck. Okay. Um, do you want his number? I can give you his number. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Let me know when you're ready. All right, go ahead. Okay.
yeah, I'd say I don't know particularly who we bought it off of. I just know I do. Um, I make homemade dog treats on the side, and he was like, mm -hmm. like, "We're buying this building so that you can turn it into your office and hmm. everything." So, <laughs> yeah, I'm, like it's a mess, though. <laughs> I'm thinking that I don't know how they the rent to own company that they owe really deal money to. Somehow they figured out it's here, so they must have had okay. contact with whoever moved it or something. Um, is is it unlocked? Um, it's not. No. Okay. It's full of crap right now too. I just wanted to see if I could get a if there's a number on the inside of the door because they should have I serial got numbers. The key for it and everything. And yeah, if you don't mind, I would like to just look at that so I can make sure it's the right one. Just um. I know um, the three two one is the back door. One four one is the front. Okay. Yeah, full stuff. Um, they don't give them serial numbers, do they? Nope. Payments on it, you think? Yeah. Because I mean, it's something it, I really like it because I eventually, I mean, I just cleaned out my storage unit and put stuff in there, but yeah. Um, yeah, it, it's it's a sticky situation because if he, because he buys it, he'll buy them rent to own and then they turn out and sell them and they never pay it off. And so now so we you pay, money for yeah, <laughs> you pay him, but we're not going to get any money back. So. Yeah. So, but I'm gonna I'm gonna take a picture of it and just send that to him verify that because okay. that one you don't have any other shits here, do you? No, just these two. This okay. one I know for sure because this one we paid Amish people to bring yeah. this one here and everything. So one's out there in Zanesville. So we yeah. got the paperwork and all of that for that one. Yeah. That one we are still paying on, but this one mm -hmm. we just paid the guy. I don't even, I can't even tell you that'd be a f like I don't even know what yeah. we ended up giving for it. But yeah, I'm guessing that's it. But I have to just verify it. Um, cause I know the, the, the rent to own company deals with that style building. I can see who the builder is. So that's why I think it's that one. Okay. But, um, all right, well, let yeah, me take it, a picture of it and okay, then, and then what, like, well, I'm sure you got a number, but, yeah. um, I definitely, I'd be interested in buying it. I know we're going to lose our butt off of it, but yeah. I'd rather pay for it and keep it yeah. than have to move everything out of it. So. Yeah, I know. Well, it, it comes down to if, if he sold it to you. He, he sold stolen property because it's not his. He never had the right to sell it. So you could probably go after him. I mean, the rent down company can give you more information on that, but okay. you can't sell something that's not yours. So okay. it's a situation, but. Yeah, just, uh, um, I mean, you, his, like I said, he's driving dump truck, he hauls gravel and everything. Yeah. So he probably can't hear and yeah. he's yep. one broken arm. So he's like one armed anyway. And still driving dump truck, wow. <laughs> All right, thank you. Okay, just gonna do an update on that one. <laughs> it was interesting. It was a 14 white building. It turns out it's it's 10 white and then it has a four foot porch. So they have it on it as a 10 foot building, but it's 14 feet wide. So I need an escort to haul that. Um, it's a little bright out here. And they say that the people there, the fiance was there, her, the girl, the woman, and then her fiance came home, and he said they're telling me that they bought it from somebody, but he didn't know who the guy's name is they bought it from. He's thinking maybe this, 
bought it off Facebook Marketplace. He didn't think it was the name that we have that it bought it originally. Um, so we're not sure. By we, I mean me and the rent to own company that I was dealing with. He talked to this guy for a while and there was just a little bit something suspicious, something that, I don't know, things don't quite add up. So we're not sure if, if he actually did pay for it because to me it's hard to, if they, if they buy it off of Facebook or somewhere, buy it off of somebody and they don't know it's rent to own, they pay money for it. I hate to make them pay for it again or lose their building but they can choose to take the person to court if they have some kind of evidence. I don't, it's just complicated. But this case, just something didn't seem quite right. It just seemed like maybe he didn't pay for it or he knew or something, I don't know. So it was full of stuff, so I left it there and he's gonna try to work it out. He sounded like he would take over the payments and buy it, so maybe. It'll all be good. Maybe I'll go back. I don't know. So either way, I could go get myself some lunch and uh, head off either back to the one I started or I might go after another one first. I'm not quite sure yet because everything's kind of up in the air now. So that's how it goes in the repo world. You don't know what you get and what you don't. So uh, later and out. Repo time. Here we go. So I forgot that I was already right here. Hmm, this is interesting. So the last one I did not get. Yep, it's back there. Wonder how that got in there. Um, so I drove here a good little ways to check this one out. I'm just trying to get parked here and get situated. And I'm trying to remember where I was at. <laughs> got to do an update it's been a crazy day i still got to go back and get the one with this lady this morning living in it but i decided to come check this one out looks like there's fans and that definitely building back there i don't know how it got there so let's go check it out about the uh, storage building that guys are renting and the payment's not being made so I'm supposed to either get it or get payment. My parents yeah. are here right now. Okay. So they're the ones I need to talk to obviously. Um, I don't know if I have a phone number for them. Is it mm -hmm. Does that sound right? That's okay. My okay. All right, well, I'm going to have to see if I can get a hold of them because once they send us out, we're supposed to either get the building or, or get payment. So, and I don't know how it even got in there. Is there an alley back there or mm. how they brought the building in? But There's probably an alley back there. It's just okay. the gate back there is kind of broken, so it's kind of yeah. open it. All right, well, I'll take a look and see if I can get a hold of them. But um, if, he, if they tell me to, I might have to go in there and get, and get it. So... Oh. Well, okay. uh, my, my parents are probably going to move back into the house. We'll probably uh, get it, give it to you guys again. Okay. Do you know when to get back here? My mom's at the dental, but my father will be back around 11. So. Okay. Okay. Well, I might see if I can get a hold of him unless you want to call him. And... You can call him right now. He's like, okay. he works in the office, so he's in that day. Okay. He doesn't really get much calls. Yeah. And that's okay all right well let me uh let me take a look at it and i'll call him and see if i can get in contact with him all right thank you there is this thing oh there it is what is c there's ac in it
Fred, he won't pick up. Anybody in here? Hello? Yep. It's definitely somebody's house. It's creepy. Is that a snake? Office slash house. Ew, there's a bucket with poop in it. Well. Start a body again. Do you, who lives in there? Uh, my parents. Oh, they live in there. Okay. Can you call one of them? Because somehow yeah. we gotta get in contact. Because he don't pick up when I call him. Okay, I'll um, call him again. Can I? Because I need to talk to him. If you can. My mom will probably be back soon. I, okay. I can't remember where she is at right now. Okay. Do you have a phone to call them or? Yeah, I do. Do you mind calling them? Yeah. So I can talk to him. Okay. Because we just we gotta get some kind of communication or something. I'm here for, uh, for, for about the building out back. Yeah, I didn't know they were scheduled for a pickup or anything. Well, if the payment's not being made and they can't reach you, then they'll send us out to get it. No, I uh, just got home like Monday. I didn't haven't checked my mail yet. Um, okay. And I don't know how much. I mean, obviously the payments were not being made. That's where they sent me out here, but I don't know. I don't really have information. I just want to make right, contact. No, I, um, well, no, well, the problem is it's, it's hooked up to electric right now, and uh, yeah, there's animals in there, so. Yeah. Um, Are you wanting to return it, or you planning really on? I want to take care of it, but I haven't been home to take care of it, so. Uh, okay. Let me call them and what's going on. Okay. You have their information? Yeah, I have. Uh, I'll look up an old email or something. Okay. Yeah. And then the phone number I have for you is... Yeah, did you just call from Mansfield? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. sorry. I was 
Yeah, right, okay. Yeah, I just I'm just trying to make con contact to make sure that we get communication. Um otherwise they're just gonna keep sending us out and eventually we'll have to take the building if nobody's here. No, I understand. Um, so. yeah, let me get the call and figure out what's up. Okay. All right, thank you. Yep. All right, thank you guys. Well, there's that one. Um, man, this job ain't always easy. At least to make contact with them. So they are now at least aware that we're here to get it and hopefully to motivate them to do something about it. So we'll see. Maybe I'll go off to another one. We'll see. A few moments later. Well, I'm hauling and tauling down the road. Going after another one. This one's a return. And I was able to call the person. Say, yep, yeah, he'll be there and uh, ready to go. So, at least this one I know I can get. And I'll look this up and head back north and uh, pick up the little one that I was at this morning. So, if I get two out of five in one day, that's... <laughs> That's not really good, but hey, it is what it is. And then there's a bridge up here. A little bit of a low bridge, so I have to watch myself when I come out of here. Anywho, I don't know yet if I'll take a video of this. I'll have to check when I get there. If I decide to record or not, but either way, catch you next time.
there's that one. Uh, I get to go get the last one yet. Easy peasy. Well, I'm back. So it's been around six, probably almost seven hours since I was here. It's crazy. It's a day actually that long. So there's no reason that she uh, can't have her stuff out. Oh, I see there's a pickup sitting there now in a van. Interesting. So, but the one car that was there isn't there anymore. I really want to, I think I'll unload, unload my mule and then I'll back in here and get turned around. Because I'm going to head out this way again, but assume everything's cleaned out. Because uh, I'm taking a risk me this time. Well, I'm back. <laughs> Took me a while, but uh, I ended up going and getting another one. She got her stuff out, and yeah, there you go. Yeah, she put the key in the door. Okay. I Perfect. Am for sure. Okay, well, I'll load it up and get it out of here. She fell behind because she had cancer. Oh, really? And then she had the surgery and the radiation, yeah. and she couldn't work. Hmm. So. Yeah, it's tough times, and she didn't want to lose it, but. Yeah. I couldn't help her. Unfortunately, they don't want to just give it away for free either, so. Well, I figured she'd pick come up get it. the payments after she got. Yeah. Because she just started back to work. Yeah. Yeah, the hard part usually is they get behind, and then you got to try to pay now plus pay right. what you're behind because they, in order to keep it, they got to pay everything they owe up. Right. So, you know, some point you're better off. Letting it go and go buy a new one. Yeah, but I've got to put up with her now. Yeah. <laughs> At least I could send her to a shed. Yeah, well, <laughs> there's a big container right there. Uh, yeah, and it's full. My husband filled that up before he passed away. Wow. <laughs> huh. It's a nice little place back in here. Thank you. All right, I'll get out of here. woman got cans here. on this one because it doesn't have four choices so I gotta use my chains and I'm just gonna drag it
I just walked out there. I wanted to realize my chains are out in the truck. So underneath here, there's nothing there to hook to, to hook on to to pull it. So I drill holes in the runner and I put a bolt through it when I chain. So uh something like this. Hey, I didn't hit a nail. Go get my chains. Sweet. Put the key on a nail in here. So, I got these chains, bolt it, weld it to a bolt, put the bolt through that hole. I can put a nut on it if I have to, but it shouldn't slip out. Put that on this hook right there, and voila, problem solved. I usually drill the hole a bit of an angle so it actually the bolt kind of goes back when I stick it in there that way it'll not slide out as easy God, I don't have this one strapped. So I better put a strap on that. Otherwise it'll slide back and uh, not make me happy. There we go.
weird. Man, was it attached or what? I didn't see nothing. Ripped a couple pieces of siding off. But I don't know what happened there. Strap them down and hit the Levi's lot and call it a day. It's been a long day. Later, y'all. Well, I made it to Levi's lot where all the buildings are. Just the load. But, you know, it wouldn't be a complete day without seeing some wasps. So. Or to get stung, you know, I, I need to get stung again. Hello, hello. I thought they're dead until I went up close. It's kind of blurry. It looks like their nest kind of fell down. Can I go in there? There we go, yeah. Look at that stuff. Watch this. Uh, hello. <laughs> okay. He's not happy to see me, so I'm going to... Make sure he don't stay happy. This stuff. Ooh. Oh, it's on. I better keep spraying. One got out. Hey, no you won't. Not today. I had enough of these. These are yellow jackets. Why is it not killing them? Uh huh. Not today, I won't. Oh, monsters.
Hey, not crawling away. I mean, not that I blame you, but hey. Where'd you go? Oh, I'm down on the... Gotcha. Well, hello. Oh, there's one not... Looking a little bit too healthy. That's crazy that they're in there. And... Actually didn't get mad or anything until... Start spraying. Wonder what happens if I open it. That's the only hole out, so I gotta protect their entrance. I think I got them. What a mess. Hey, I'm just making sure that nobody else gets stung. I'm doing my part to protect the community. That's what I'm doing. Okay, there you have it. I didn't even get stung. It's kind of weird that that looks like a wasp. Maybe those are male and female. There's one in there that was very yellow. That I thought was a yellow jacket. Man. Put a lot of spray on there. There's their eight too. We don't need more of you. Okay. Let's call it a wrap. Drop these babies off and go home and... See what my wife got for dinner. <laughs>